Hey everybody, Scott Spritzer here at DocSports.com. Been a couple of days, been just like you, watching all this craziness going on in the U.S. and the world. And uh, listen, I'm not here to talk about a lot of that. I don't know any more about it than you do. Uh, so I watch the people who do, the experts on that. But uh, what we were going to do from time to time, though, is pop in when we're going to be making bets. And I'm going to give you uh, my bet for UFC on ESPN 28. Takes place on Saturday in Brazil. And uh, the card goes on as of midnight Pacific time Friday night Saturday morning uh, Dana White says the fight card will continue of course they're fighting in Brazil without fans in attendance so what the heck I am in the fight game I've been having a real nice 2020 uh, in the fight game both UFC and of course in boxing and uh, we're going to look to continue that role going as we are up around a, about a thousand dollars for those wagering a hundred dollars per unit so far in 2020 uh, so let's keep it going and uh, again here's what I'm going to do uh, if I'm making a bet on something, I'm going to do a video and tell you about it. I'm going to share whatever I'm doing. And uh, as far as the fight game is concerned, they're expected not only to have this fight card tonight on Saturday night or Saturday afternoon in some spots, uh, but also next week there's another fight card scheduled for the 21st. So uh, we will be popping in from time to time, at least a couple of times next week, even if there's no new news when it comes to the other sports to talk about UFC a little bit next week's card. And uh, hopefully we'll get NASCAR back in a couple of weeks. Uh, we thought there we're going to run in Atlanta on Sunday. They decided to cancel it. So could have NASCAR after the postponements in Atlanta and Miami. Let's hope that happens. And uh, again, we'll be popping in from time to time. So if you want to uh, subscribe, go ahead and do that. You'll know exactly when we're doing new videos. Uh, I imagine uh, we probably won't have another video here for a couple of days, but you never know. Maybe we'll come back on Sunday and do a little recap, talk about what's going on in the world of sports betting. As you know, right now, basically all you got uh, in Las Vegas at the sports books or the race books and the other reason they're open is for the most part horse racing and that's just about it and of course we've got this fight card in brazil so let's get to it uh the fight card starts around 3 30 p.m eastern time 12 30 pacific the fight that we are involved in is the main event it is kevin lee taking on charles Oliveira. that fight uh is going to go around 7 45 p.m eastern 4 45 p.m pacific time espn uh 28 and uh, listen, what I'm going to do with this fight is uh, I'm going to lay that price with Kevin Lee. Right now, as I speak, he's about a $1.45 favorite. And uh, it is a step up in competition for all of Vera guys. Uh, Kevin Lee's already been fighting a much more difficult slate of opponents. Degree of difficulty, if you will, has been in his favor. It's an ob obvious advantage for Kevin Lee. Uh, he's had no issue uh, fighting in Brazil against Brazilian fighter. You'll recall uh, Kevin Lee's win over Trinidad. Now, there is a difference here because he doesn't have to deal with the Brazilian fans rooting for the other fighter. There's going to be nobody in attendance other than essential personnel. Uh, so that's an advantage for Kevin Lee in this particular fight. So you got Oliveira, who's probably going to do his best to pressure uh, Kevin Lee. He's going to come in and, and swing some haymakers and try to get the fight over early, all that good stuff. But Kevin Lee jabs really well with his left. And then he follows it with a real nice right. And he's a wrestling-based fighter who can also strike. And I think he's going to be a little bit too much for Charles Oliveira, who, again, hasn't been fighting the best level of competition uh, when you match him up against Kevin Lee and who he's fought. And, fought. and I think that's going to be a bit of a difference maker here. So a slight class difference here in favor of Kevin Lee, guys. And that's that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to back Kevin Lee minus $1.45, telling you exactly what I'm going to do on the fight card on Saturday, March 14th uh, for free. Don't have to purchase anything. Let's do this. Let's get a win. Let's enjoy some sports. Oh, for the first time in a few days. And listen, I really hope you all stay healthy. I do appreciate all of those who watch these videos every day, whether you click thumbs up or thumbs down, man, I appreciate it all. And, uh, and of course, for those of you who do subscribe. So let's grab, jump on board and I'm gonna lay a buck 45 with Kevin Lee in uh, Saturday's UFC. And again, check back, we'll be popping and out over the next week. And as uh, if sports decides to, uh, the sporting world decides to uh, come back to us, NBA, uh, NASCAR, things of that nature, as soon as we hear updates, we'll be doing videos and talking about our plans for the upcoming betting future. Until then, everybody stay healthy, take care of your families, all that good stuff, and uh, let's get a win out of Kevin Lee on Saturday, all right? Scott Spritzer, DocSports.com. Let's put it in the win column on Saturday.